my friend. I'm so glad you're able to join me here for a slice and a piece of cake. My friend, it is Fay Maison Friday. Fay Maison, of course, means homemade in French. And today I'm so excited to be sharing with you this dish from childhood. It is braised arrowroot with a cured pork belly. Now, I picked up this cured pork belly from the Dollar Meat Store in Chinatown. Now, the Dollar Meat Store has been around since I was a kid. That's a long time. So, the star of the show is the arrowroot. And, of course, we're going to need some cured pork belly. We're also going to need some lump sugar as well as some red fermented bean curd, and this is my preferred brand. We're also going to need some green onions, but I just have some green onion tops. So my friends, let's get in the kitchen and recreate this dish from childhood. First thing we're going to do is we're going to cut the top and the bottom off the arrowroot. Then we're going to peel it. Now the arrowroot, the texture is very unique to me. It's kind of like between a potato and a water chestnut. Okay, we're peeling it. Now the arrowroot is only available about four months out of the year. It usually comes out in November until like after Chinese New Year. Okay, so it's peeled. We're going to put it in a plastic bag and we're going to use a cleaver or a meat tenderizer and we're just going to break up the arrowroot. It's just less messy if you do it in a plastic bag. Now we've diced up the cured pork belly. Now we're going to take out a couple cubes of the red fermented bean curd. We're also going to take out some liquid. That is liquid gold. The flavor is undescribable. It is rich. It is, it's umami. It works so well in this dish. Okay, we're just going to mash it up and uh, we're ready to get cooking. Let's add some oil in a pan. Heat up the pan. And then we're going to put in the lump sugar. I'm going to break that up. Let it melt a little, dissolve. And then we're going to render the cured pork belly. At this point, you can add the red fermented bean curd. The flavor would be that much more intense. Again, I'm going to let this render. And we're going to add the arrowroot. Stir that up. Now we're going to add the red fermented bean curd. I'm going to stir it up, ensure that the arrowroot is coated with this delicious goodness. Now we're going to add water to the top uh, just to cover the arrowroot. We're going to add the green onions. And we're going to let it braise 35 to 40 minutes. Ensure that you're stirring it every so often. And if the water is um, evaporated, just add a little bit more water because the flavor's already developed. Now, at the end of cooking, add some granulated sugar. That's what my dad used to do, but it's up to you. I can't wait to dig into this bowl of arrowroot. Uh, with this cured pork belly. Now, this is definitely not something you'll find at any restaurant. And I just love eating it with rice. I'm happy just eating rice with sauce. And this sauce is absolutely delicious. Really rich flavor. Mmm. Woo! I hope my mom and dad are proud. Let's get eating. So if you never had arrowroot, I mean, the texture is between um, a potato and a water chestnut, and it's really unique. It's not something that uh, you find year round. It's only available from November to April. Now, I still saw some in Chinatown. I think I'm gonna have to make some and freeze it. Excited for this. There's the uh, cured pork belly. Mmm. And that fermented bean curd, that flavor, you can't replicate. 
Mm. Takes me back to childhood. Mm. Mm hmm. Mm. Wow. Mm. So good. If this is a dish that you grew up eating, I hope that you'll go out and try to um, replicate it. I still see some arrowroot um, in the stores. Probably won't be here for very long. It's absolutely delicious. Again, you're not gonna find this at any kind of restaurant. I can't stop eating. If you like this video, my friend, if you could click the thumbs up button below. If you're not subscribed to my channel, I hope that you consider um, hitting the subscribe button and walking with me on this YouTube journey. My friends, take care, stay safe, stay hydrated. We will see you in the next video. Mm. Mm. Absolutely delicious.